maybe not obviously practicing, but what kind of things on the field or even in the, the meeting room kind of thing were you able to do? Just continue to learn, continue to uh, sharpen up everything that uh, I've learned up to this point. Um, obviously, you can always get better with the playbook. You can always study um, and just learn from the other guys what they did. Um, obviously, I only have uh, the one game to study from, but you know, when those guys are in, I can also study from them. So I just do my best to, to sharpen all the little things and try to make sure that I'm ready uh, when my opportunity comes. And so you said every day is an opportunity, but this game specifically, Jay being hurt, Corey being hurt, holding Darren out, do you see the chance for more carries than maybe you typically would have otherwise? Uh, it's just about going out there and competing. Um, we don't count carries, we don't count, you know, anything like that. Uh, every time you get out there, there's a chance for you to go out there and ball. So that's what we're doing, and that's what we're focusing on. Um, no matter who's in there, I know that you know we got each other's back, and we're gonna we're gonna do the thing when it comes down to it. What's it gonna take for you to get all the 53? Um, I'm, I'm focusing on uh, just playing ball. I'm blessed to be here. Like I said before, every opportunity I get is a blessing, uh, and, and that's their job. Whatever they decide uh, is gonna be. But my my thing is just enjoying my time now, taking each day uh, and playing like it's my last and, and trying to have fun with it. So how's your health now compared to when you're putting up those numbers in every game last year? <laughs> uh, it's pretty good. I, those were uh, good times. I, I was, uh, thank God I was able to be a part of a uh, university like that. Um, and I'm even more blessed to be here. So uh, hopefully we can, you know, do the same thing, if not better. But you're as healthy now as you were then? Healthier now, how would you characterize yourself? Is this you're talking about? Your health, in, in, in terms of your body. You feel healthier than you were then, as healthy as you at, were then? At Notre Dame, you're yeah. saying? Yeah. Yeah, I feel pretty good. I feel stronger. Um, I, I did a lot of training in the off season. Um, just different things than what I was used to when I was at Notre Dame. So I definitely feel stronger in that sense. And I definitely feel like um, the shape that I'm in is is different. I wouldn't say uh, new, but it's definitely different. I have more time to focus on those things, whereas, um, you know, I didn't have a lot of time then. So it's, this, it's similar workouts and training regimen, you're just doing more of it, or are there different lifts, exercises, things that you're doing to get yourself in shape? Um, I, I, I'm just focusing more on, um, you know, the athletic side of things. You know, at Notre Dame, obviously, uh, it's a great university where you get uh, academics and you get athletics so um, you got to dedicate your time to both of those things whereas now I'm able to really um, perfect my craft and really dedicate my time to uh, doing all the little things with my body taking care of it and trying to get stronger and faster and make sure that I'm ready when I get on the field. Well, that's what I mean I, I know you have more time but right. are you doing different are you, are you you taking different measures than you did at Notre Dame or are you doing exactly what you did at Notre Dame you're just doing more of it? Um, I'm doing that and then some. They, exactly. they had a, a great uh, staff and a great program as far as, uh, you know, the weight room and, and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. They have a great staff there. But I, I take that, uh, what I learned from there, and try to add my own things to it. I, I know my body um, better than anybody does, so I try to see what works for me and see what doesn't. You mentioned that you try to take everything day by day and just focus on today. Is that tough to do? Because ultimately you're here to try to make a roster and carve out a career. Nah, man, football is uh, it is a lot of fun. It's, it's, it's my dream and something that I love to do. So at the end of the day, I'm blessed to come out here and play. Um, just focusing on what, what God got me here for. Um, making decisions and all that, you know, 53, that's that's upstairs, that's that's their decision, coaches and everybody like that. My my decision is to come out here and play football. When, when they're making that decision and they're looking on the names and they see Josh Adams, what, what do you want them to think of? I mean, they can, they can think what they want to think. I, hopefully they, you know, anybody who makes that 53, obviously they feel like that's a player that can help the team and help the organization. So. Um, just judge me like everybody else. Um, I mean, I guess the question is, how do you want to be viewed as a player? Just a player that goes out there and, and is an athlete. Anywhere you put them, trying to contribute and help the team in any way that is possible. Uh, that's what I try to do each and every practice is whatever they ask me to do, go out there and do it. Thank you. Josh, you had a taste of playing in the first preseason game. You had to miss the last one. So what's it going to be like being back out there on Thursday night? 
It's going to be a lot of fun. I'm going to try to go out there and have fun. It's going to be uh, my, my first away game, so um, just enjoying the time that I have out there. The first game, you know, I tried to have fun. You know, you get everything out, and uh, oh, you good. And, and this game, just try to do much of the same, try to improve on, you know, what I did, you know, the first time. Does it help the fact that you have that one game under your belt so you know somewhat what to expect emotionally and once you get out there on the field from a speed standpoint? Um, yeah, I mean, it's going to be a lot of fun. Football is football. Um, not much changes about that except for, you know, a couple of little things. But uh, I'm just excited to get out there, get back out there. Where, where, do you think, where do you think you've evolved the most as a player since you've arrived here? Um, just off the field, just um, being smarter with, with the playbook, uh, really uh, keying in and, and making sure that I'm ready for, you know, when I get out there, just trying to get all the details right and make sure I'm prepared, being better prepared, I would say. That's where I've grown the most. Um, of course, I'm trying to, you know, grow in all areas uh, of my play, including on the field. So each and every day I try to work on something different, something new.